what's up everybody it's your boy mike rasheed i am at the original the mighty ieg right here in long beach california shout out to my pop ct motherfucking fletcher uh today i got the crew with me i got big rob i got uh simeon panda and i also got special guest mac truck cool ass dude always in shape strong all of that shit we all connect on very similar uh vibes with training so we're like fuck it let's put all our minds together and, and smash uh some chess but today what we want to do is give you guys a very comprehensive breakdown of how to train your chess so this is for beginners to an extent but this is something that i really want to drive home to you guys the way a beginner train and the way an advanced person train sometimes is very similar okay so you only have one chest, you know what I mean? It's only so many ways you can train your chest. Now, excuse me, there's a lot of different things you can do, but in my opinion, if you stick to the basics, that's all you need. Do the basics properly. There's times that I'm in gyms and I see trainers with people, they can have a skinny dude and they'll have them training chest on like uh, hammer strength, uh, 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 bench press with no weight on it or just very little weight with bands around it trying to be all fancy no put that get off of the fucking machine put that dude on the bench press and teach him a proper way to bench and build his strength and his chest up the proper way nothing builds a chest like a bench press now there might be people out there who can argue that and they might be right but this is the way that i know how to do it okay so we're going to run through the basics but you want to do the basics properly okay to get the most out of it all right let's rock uh, uh, I'm retired, man. I'm retired. There's nothing wrong with strippers. I used to, I got a lot of homegirls at strip, but and I used to go to strip club all the time, but I I would never get no dance. I thought it was lame. I would go there, yeah, I would go there to rendezvous like with the squad. We meet up there pre it. and usually I'm dating somebody where we at, so. Yeah. You know, yeah. but I never, I, I would look at people getting dances and they, they, they be like, they look like they in heaven. I'm like, you an idiot, bro. This is important information for you young guys out there. If you go to a strip club, be cool. <laughs> Don't get no dance. He's like an asshole. If you go there, go to the, that's like the pre it with the squad before y'all go out. You know what I mean? Or if you dating somebody at the strip club, you know, you go hit her with a fat tip. You know what I'm saying? Just, you know, whatever. But don't be getting no dances because they, they do not like you. Nah, they don't. They giving that same spiel to everybody in there. Yo, come on, I'm gonna do a nut. The place was moving and shit. Yes. Rolling, I'm like, hold oh, no. up. So, I was like, hey, just to let you know. I just like this. That's not real. When I first got on YouTube, everybody was mad at me because of that overtraining video. I was like, fuck it, overtraining is good. Right. But what I think it was is motherfuckers was like, fuck, this motherfucker, his video was official. They killing it, me and CT, they killing it, they funny, like everything was on point. On point. So a lot of people were like, you can't do that, you can't train like that. And, and the Hodge twins, shout out to Hodge twins, they're my, they're my peoples now, but they was going hard. Bro. You can't do that. I was like, look, maybe y'all can't do it. But you know what I'm saying? And I was like, look, you can't say what someone can't do if you haven't done it or tried it. Exactly. And then I got into like, we could, you know, we can get in the gym and battle it out. Yeah, I said, we could do basketball, we could race. <laughs> yeah. I was like, anything athletic, you know what I'm saying? Nobody steps Bro, the their, their fans, hard, you though. bitch, yeah. you bitch. <laughs> I don't back down to nothing, but I was like, I'm gonna delete this video. <laughs> I'm gonna delete this video. Hey, shout out to the Hodge Twin, Twins fans. Y'all got some loyal motherfucking fans, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They went. But this is when I was nobody on the internet. They, oh my, I deleted the video, they go to the next video. Why'd you delete the video, you bitch? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. I respect it though, I respect it. Yeah. Hey, they was, on, they was on my head, bro. Hey, they, they, was, hurting my, they was hurting my little feelings. <laughs> oh yeah. 
The internet is a cold place. The internet is a cold place. Oh, numbers win. Oh, man. Oh, no, 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 no. And, and here's the thing, but, but here's, yeah. the, here's the thing about it, right? Oh, he's from London. So fucking what? Maybe he was raised in Atlanta. Have you ever thought that? You know what I'm saying? Like, who cares? Like, what? I don't, I don't see the scandal in that. You know what I'm saying? So it, it's just, you know, people, but you're right. No one cares. <laughs> oh, everybody got pulling out. Jimmy got like a 90 inch reach. Nah, uh, it wasn't mad. I was disappointed. I'm gonna tell you that. Oh yeah. I can see because I because it's like cause, cause you look like me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they tried. They been following the nigga around the expo all last. In all honesty, all honesty, bro. I hate violence. I absolutely hate violence. Anytime I got in a fight when I was younger, I felt like the worst person in the world. You know what I'm saying? My conscience would eat at me so bad. That's why I be so calm now these days, bro. Yeah. It's, 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 it's like, it's, it's, but really, I didn't feel bad for him. It's the, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I felt bad then, but. Because you never got to say, my bad. Yeah, because you know, like, they, like life is, try to get us is nothing. To uh -huh. by stuff. I did mine by myself. Mm. But I put it out there before the nigga died. I'm like, he's just a family member I decide to just not fuck with. Like, yeah. I don't hate the nigga. I just don't the fuck thing with The thing is, the thing is, it's like, you know, we learn this shit when we get older, but right. fighting is, is stupid. It's like an animal. It's like, I can't express myself to you, so yeah. I'm going to punch you. You know what yeah, I'm saying? It, it's, it's so, it's weak. You know what I mean? I feel like, if, like, you know, the way I come up with my cousins, everybody, like, we have a disagreement, we can't get along, we're going to fight, and then we love each other afterwards. Mm -hmm. It's weird, right? And, and in boxing, it's the same. If me and you are sparring partners, we could fucking go to war, and we love each other. It's like we understand, and we respect yeah, each respect other. Them. You know what I'm saying? So I guess in that sense, but that ain't really how people get down out here. Like, you get in a fight with somebody, it's fucking beef, and it's a war. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? So I, I just think it's so unnecessary. And it's so fucking, it's animalistic, and we ain't animals, you know what I'm saying? All right. Man, are y'all counting the reps? Me and Rob was, we used to be such BFFs on the weights. We wouldn't let nobody spot each other, spot, spot the other. <laughs> like, nah, watch out, bro. I got it, I got it, bro. <laughs> hey, sure. I got it. He like it spotted by a certain way. For real. Because we didn't trust nobody else. But uh, we was always going super heavy, too. I got you, man. It's your fresh ass pants. With the fresh ass pants. Hey, they gave me some. I got some from Fashion Nova. Uh -huh. I got one good wear off the motherfuckers. <laughs> That's they, the they, they was fresh though. You want to lift? I never used to freaking. When I was four, I used to bench on it. I used to touch the chest. Didn't touch. It's all good. Me too. Me too. Me too. Me too. Me too. I used to go up here and. Right, 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 right. 
But I mean, you want to see this thing. You got to stop it in mid air, too. That's kind of hard to do. Yeah, it's kind of hard to do. You but, do. but if you come in close. Yeah. But some people might go here. Nah, yeah, yeah. They're like, they could like, bench 800. I remember when I was younger, when I, I never used to touch chest. Oh, like, yeah, you used to just go right yeah. here. <laughs> How old were you when you started training? 14. What about you? Shit, five. Damn. Yeah, I got picked on the ground with a six pack at six oh, years shit. old. 14. 14. Yeah, yeah I remember. Whoa, wow. I remember when I. Uh, Excuse me. I'm at a bench press. I had this girl from school. She came over. Well, she came to the backyard. I had 135 on. Smashing it, right? I'm like 14. She was so impressed. And that shit just had me locked in. She was like, that's like a man. That's like something a man would do. It's like a man. You're like a man. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I love this shit. I love, I love the iron, baby. A girl would come over, like even when I was older, when I was in college. A girl coming over, I'm on like 800 push-ups. I come to the door, out of breath. Why are you out of breath? I just ran to the door, I didn't hear. I didn't know how long he was at the door. <laughs> yeah, I'm all, my little baby pump. And then when I see pictures of myself back then, I'm like, what was I thinking? I thought I was swole. When I was skinny, I was like shredded. Same, same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will wear I will wear the tank tops that I make fun of people wearing back then, and I had no business wearing that shit. It's like you wanted to show off your little gains. You know what I mean? All you young dudes out there, I know y'all doing it now. Y'all got the tank tops all the way down to here. You gonna look back on these pictures in five, ten years, and you gonna be like, what the fuck was I thinking? Oh no, we all yeah, that was. Kind of, yeah, man. Bro, you could. Yep. Yep. Easy. Good shit. Good shit, good shit. And look, let me tell y'all something. Like, we all covered up right now, but y'all know we have decent physiques. And we're putting up decent weight, good weight. And we probably won't go as heavy as we can normally go. But y'all know the resume. Y'all know we go hard. Y'all want to be those kind of people. You don't want to be the person. Well, actually, you can do whatever you want to do. But you don't want to be, I don't want you to want to be the person that looks awesome and can't get busy. Get busy, it's impressive. My thing, part of the reason why I train so hard and always have is like going to different, when I was younger, um, there was a gym, like a little community center. It was in Brooklyn, it was on Linden Boulevard and it was like pff, motivation. Like a, it was like this, like Iron Addicts, but half the size less than half the size and they was in there going hard, right? And I was a little dude and I would be loading up a bunch of weight and I could see the older dude like kind of like, look at this idiot, watch he hurt himself, right? <laughs> but I would get under there and smash it, you know what I mean? I was always strong. So I love that shit. So my thing was always, I want to be, I know I ain't gonna be the biggest dude, but I want to be the strongest or one of the strongest in any gym at any given time. And it's, that's, you know, and it, it, it is working out like that. And so they got installs in us too, though. Yeah, and it feels good yeah. to have that kind of, kind of uh, 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 self-esteem. You know what I'm saying? That, that that kind of confidence, and that shit carries into other aspects of my life too. You know what I mean? So do yourself a favor. Don't just look the part. Be the part. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just strong. I don't mean to cut you off. This is motivation. Oh, six shit. years old, full-blown six-pack. Look at this, look at this dude. He was, he was on, on Trimbalone <laughs> at, at an early age, at six. <laughs> he had delts, chest, and abs. Genetics, boy. Yeah, Genetics. Genetics. People talk so much shit, they forget about, <laughs> some people happen to have some decent genetics, all right? It is what it is. <laughs> I got him, yep. I got it. I mean, we, we're technically animals. We tighter. You don't want it on there? Man, you, you complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Loving you is complicated. <laughs> you tell me that all the time. Why is it like you complicated? Yeah.
I, I like shit how I like it. Yeah. You got like a little bit of OCD. Yeah. Uh, OCD nah, 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 nah. You don't know. This dude is a I'm, hypochondriac, bro. Yes, I am. Really? Every yes. week he, he hit me thinking he got cancer. <laughs> <laughs> Not cancer though, not cancer. Nah, it, you have. Wrong. It has yeah, been. I have been before. Bro. That nigga doctor hates it. You know what I'm nah, she, nah, she, she actually. They getting paid off this motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you like it. Go with this shit. Gotta talk about the ladies. Man. <laughs> nah, sometimes I be really fucked up. No, you don't. <laughs> I really be fucked up. No, you don't. I really be fucked up. You're a healthy young man. Like what? Uh, Headache. Hey, look, we were talking about motorcycles, right? Mm. He was like, nah, I ain't gonna get a heart attack. So I've been like, when I'm an old man, when I'm older, I said, yeah, like, what age you talking about? He said, like, 40. 40. I was like, what? <laughs> Max, like, I'm 45. I said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Max, would you call me old? Yeah, I said, nah, I ain't You wanna live? Yeah. You do? Yeah, come on. Let's get it. Let's go. That just sound like grown man weight. <laughs> you know what I'm I see what this is right now. Y'all rolling? They trying to put that pressure on me. I see what this is. Oh, nah, like, man. You know what I'm saying? They trying, to put that, they trying to put that pressure on me. This is easy for Mac. Yeah, uh-huh. Team 18 Wheeler. Yeah, uh-huh. You want to lift? You want to lift? Nah, I got it. Okay. <clears throat> Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Easy. Good shit, good oh. shit, baby. Ooh. Sim, was you going up or you want to no, maintain? You want to go up? Come on, Sim. Let's get it. Grab it. Oh. Come on. Come on. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Easy. Go. Got that. Baby. Damn. Good strong. shit. Right. <laughs> strong and shredded looking ass. Oh, yeah, look at that, man. All right, so I'm gonna give y'all a secret right now. Secret to being strong, wear a hoodie. For whatever reason, I feel strong in a hoodie. I know, right? This is weird. I'm kidding. That's why, I like, I don't really do curls any, anymore because of y'all. They have, we curling the barbell with, Stupid shit. We did some dope shit though, some fun shit. <laughs> but first time we trained together, it was an arm workout. I'm like, this is gonna be boring. How hard can an arm workout be? <laughs> oh my god, bro. <laughs> Fuck. That shit was life changing. Because <laughs> at first I was avoiding bra. I was like, eh. he's like, let's train. I'm like, eh. I'd be like, yeah, two o'clock. <laughs> I train at I train at eleven. <laughs> Cause you gotta understand, like I'm new. I was new in town. I didn't know anybody. I didn't know Rob, and Rob a big, scary looking motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, who are these motherfuckers? And I just I just be standoffish when I don't know people. It's funny because I got I got one of my one of my closest friends. Mm -hmm. I remember the first time I saw him. I thought, who the hell is this dude, man? Like, <laughs> Look at this dude. He walked in. I was like, I was at college, and um, he walked in. He had his hair up, like plaited up, right. like a pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> Looking like a pineapple. <laughs> yeah. Now nah, we're close friends. Yeah. We're close friends for like ten years, and I still think he's a funny dude. Right, 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 right. <laughs> but, but we're close friends. It's just funny how when you think back to you know right. when you first met someone. And yeah, I, I had a I prejudged Rob. I was like, oh, this, I thought he was cocky. <laughs> he had a mohawk with lines and shit, <laughs> and he was shredded. Motherfucker legs was like, yeah. and I see up to that point, I didn't know shit about steroids. So I was like, he on steroids. You can't get laid down on steroids. Yeah. I didn't know, bro. Really I didn't know about the diets and shit yeah. like that. Yeah. But Rob looked impressive. That height with the same big ass legs, but shredded and shit. I was like, that's fucking crazy. Yeah. But we, we just, like, I avoided him like a motherfucker. And he was persistent. I, I respect people that's persistent, but not annoying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then CT, 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 yeah, exactly. You know what I'm 
And then CT made us work out together. <laughs> and that shit was fucking. I'm telling you, bro, I had no expectations of it being a good workout. I'm thinking arms. That shit was fucking crazy, bro. <laughs> Y'all ever do like a CrossFit workout? Like a crazy ass, hard ass CrossFit workout? Yeah, no, I ain't do that. That's like when you like gassed out? That's how we was with arms. Bro, it's crazy. And then we just kept doing it, like coming up with stupider shit. Now they not. Mm. Oh. Yeah, I did. All right, come on. Like they used to work, but then I warm so much to where they start getting weak. All right, I got it. No, no, no. Ooh. <laughs> it's it, my, it hurts my joints. I'm going to tell y'all something, man. You can get strong. And I think, I think my nutrition right now, I don't eat a lot. And I think I might need collagen in my diet because my joints hurt like a motherfucker. Right when I start, very first rep. But also, I'm not training that heavy these days. Yeah. So... Yeah. He's just trying to show his biceps. That's all I'm worth. Yeah, don't 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 spot like that. He's just showing off. He's showing off. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. One more. Easy. Yeah, I can't lift off like like this. Yeah. Yeah, nah, Y'all see that? Oh, yeah, you don't see worry that? About, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Thank you, Mac. Thank you. Thank you. Let me hang. Hang. Look Let me hang. hang. Look at him. He don't care nothing about You don't care about no Nobody but yourself. Let me hang him. Oh. <laughs> nah, it's cool. Nah, it's cool. I already took that. Thank you, Matt. <laughs> hey, you know what's crazy? I don't know. I think maybe people think I'm mean, but I get left hanging all the time. I'm always like, all right, we talking? All right. And they just walk off. They assume that I don't want to shake their hand. Yeah. I'd be like, hey. I'd just be like, hey. Um, I doubt myself. Yeah. Oh, man. You did my boy wrong on camera. Though. It's on camera. Oh, man. My bad. You can keep hey, it. It's cool. Hey, I want no, the people to see it. You said you was avoiding them, though. Oh, it's payback. It's payback. Okay. <laughs> payback. All right. We know what happened. Yep. Down. Come on, Mac. Come on. Yeah. Yep. Easy. On, Mac, Mac strong. This dude's stronger than the motherfucker. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Good shit. I'm gonna tell y'all something. When you gain a certain level of strength and you keep maintaining, you don't lose it that easy. You don't lose it that easy, honestly. I remember last year, bro, we went to Detroit and I was already not lifting anymore, getting ready for the fight. A couple months in, remember? And I hit 405 on the bench and I wasn't lifting at all at that point. So you, you get strong. We were just talking about another thing. When people build their bodies the right way, it's really hard to lose yeah. your gains, right? Yeah. Strength is the last thing to go. Yep. Your, your size will go, but you'll still maintain a certain level of fullness and muscularity when you uh, have built it the right way. Because I've seen people that must not have built it the right way, a month off, they look like they never lifted before. And they were bigger than me.
wear it like that. Come on. Good. Come on. Come on. Alright y'all, you see we getting it in and we talking a whole lot of shit and we got a lot more to talk so I'm going to cut it right here and stay tuned for part two. I might give it to you tomorrow, maybe the next day, it depends. If I get enough likes and shares on this one, you get it tomorrow. Alright, let's go.